Hello everyone, welcome back to the show. In today's news, Owen Jones claims Meghan Markle is a huge threat due to impact Duchess has on the royal family. Meghan Markle was quick to join other senior members of the royal family in the highest popularity rank among Britons, placing sixth behind husband Prince Harry, the Queen and Prince Philip in a little over a year. The Young Gov poll questioned 8,954 Britons between June 2018 and June 2019, finding the Duchess of Sussex has gathered much support from the younger generations. Political commentator Owen Jones claimed Meghan's reputation activists became because of the boost she is providing the family with. Ms. Jones, Mr. Jones said, I would actually prefer a head of state and she is actually a threat to people like me. If the royal family is going to stay popular with a new generation, then they need to change. They need to modernize. They need to reflect and look at a bit like the public they represent. Since joining the royal family in 2018, Meghan Markle became one of the most popular and recognized figures across the world. The Duchess of Sussex fully embraced her role, taking on several charitable causes and slowly moving away from royal tradition to bring in more modern touches to the monarchy with husband Prince Harry. However, the former American actress has had to conform with some of the strictest re requirements for the royal protocol, but had faced reportedly struggled to adapt. Royal author Angela Levin earlier this month said, she's very good at talking to people. It's an awful lot to learn and she's very energetic and keen, but it might be good for her if she took a little bit of more advice. Before in her life, she was very used to making her own decisions. I do think it's very difficult for her. This is very strict traditional path. It takes a while to get used to it. And Meghan's new life as a royal has also faced some intense criticism due to her personal take on her role and her expectations for more privacy from the media. Both the Duke and the Duchess of Sussex are known to be very mindful of the privacy, but their growing demands have sparked a backlash from royal fans. The couple kept quiet on plans for the birth of their son, Archie Harrison Mountbatten Windsor, choosing to reveal the baby was born hours after they welcomed him. They also chose not to reveal which hospital they used, only letting the public know with the re release of Archie's birth certificate when he turned two weeks old. Meghan and Harry also withheld details of Archie's christening at Windsor Castle in July. Miss Kooning said, It is very difficult to strike a balance between private and public. The negative coverage of the Duke and Duchess of Sussex, especially the Duchess, may certainly have played a role in their desire kept details private. For fear that the press would have found and hounded the godparents, the royal expert added that the more the couple face criticism, the easier it is for them to guard their privacy. The negative coverage plays right into the Sussex's hands, she said. They don't want to subject their son to this, and they want to raise him largely out of the limelight, but the grandson of a king, nephew of a queen, cousin of a king. But he and any siblings will be living with their lives without the royal fanfare. And that is all for today's episode. Thank you for watching. If you liked it, leave a like and subscribe, and we'll see you next time.